Okay, great 10. So we are continuing on 7.2. We are applying the same steps in these freehand drawings that we will apply in the actual instrument drawings that's going to follow soon. So please start getting used to the steps that we take. All right. First things first is we look at what is given. They've given us three views, a top view, a front view, and a left view. Just remind yourself of that X, Y axis so that you remember that's the top, that's the front, that's the left. Okay? You can use some color coding if you want to. Let's say that's our front, that's our left. Why am I doing this? Because in my isometric the different views need to be reflected here. If I look at that front view, it's going to have to be visible from the front. We just do it in construction here, just for you, it's again something that will do more formally, but there's always a 30 degree line there, and there's always a perpendicular line. And then I identify what view. This one here is our front view, and this one here is our left view. So if I look from this side, I want to see my orange part. If I look from this side, I want to see my yellow part. And of course, then there's also a top. All right. So from the front, what I want to see, I want to see that square with a square hole in it. It's got one, two, three, four, five. So there's a certain height to it. So I'm going to have to copy that height. Normally, you'll use a ruler to measure. In this case, we're just going to count our um, graph. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Sometimes it feels to me like I can't count. One, two, three, four, five. And up. So that's the outside edge. On the inside. Sure. Alright, then on the left hand side we've got a thickness of 2, don't skip drawing these drawings fully because it just prepares you for what is to come, okay, if you, if you have great understanding of this, good job, then still try and draw it to the best of your ability, okay, if you have a little bit of a wobble on a line like that, let's rub it out, fix it. Make sure the quality is good. Okay. Now I ask myself, if I look from the front, is that what I see in yellow there? It is. If I look from the left in orange, yes. What is missing is that hidden detail. If you look there, there's a depth here that we have to insert. And now it looks complete. Okay. Does that make sense to you? All right. So that width and that width is the same. All right. Let's move on to the one on the right hand side because they've just upped the... Difficulty of this one, again, a front view, a left view, and a top view. I'm not going to color this one in. I think by now, um, if you need to, you can do that. But pay attention to point A because it's, again, the one that's given here. Just for yourself, help yourself out as a first step, a 30 degree on this end, 30 degree on this end, and up. And then label for me, the next thing you do is you label your views. I want this to be my front view. I want this one to be my left view and the top of score. So on the front, we need to draw that. So it's two blocks, space, two blocks, and it repeats all around. So we've got two blocks here. And a space, two more blocks. Then we go up. Two blocks again, a space, two blocks. Okay, then we go to the. This indent here is just one block. Are you guys enjoying these new found? Drawings. Okay. Oh, this one is two blocks. Thank you for noticing. Now 
Happy chappy. All right. On the left hand side, we've got a width of two blocks. Okay, if I look at the left, what do I see here? I see these two surfaces. I see that back line. There's also another line at the back. It's in one block and then up. Right, and it goes across here. Okay. In my depth for my top view. All right. I stand back, I have a look at my drawing, and I realize I've missed one or two lines. Can you see where that is? Can you see which lines I'm missing on this drawing? And that's part of your own steps. You can't just say, ah, I'm done, and good luck with the rest. Double check, because what? On this one, there's a depth here. Okay? Hey, someone... Hey, Aaron H., Thanks for the great content. Very helpful. That's the first time that those uh, comments have popped up. Thank you, Aaron. Appreciate the comment. Good job. Someone's actually watching these videos. Great. All right. So there's the depth also. All right. Um, happy with that, kids? I wish you guys would give some feedback. Like, <laughs> you want some comments from the class? Let's hear. Uh, good job, sir. Good job. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Happy for that. Thank you so much. Make sure, double check again, that your front view looks like the one given your left view, as well as your top view. Radio, thank you, Klaus and Aaron, for watching. All the best. Now it's your turn.